you guys, Matt Allen here. Welcome back to Tactical Bassin. Today we are not going bass fishing. We are doing something a little bit different, but we are going fishing. About a year ago, I did a video with you guys talking about getting burned out and how to avoid it, getting back to your roots, doing things a little different once in a while. Basically, we spend all our time teaching you guys how to catch giant fish how to fine tune your bass fishing. But there's a lot of energy in that. It's not always just relaxing fishing when you're out there trying to catch a personal best or a monster bass. So about once a year, it's really important that you just take a break, relax, go back to your roots. Whether that's fishing for little panfish, fishing for trout, you gotta take a break. Remember what it's all about. Remember that love for fishing that got you started in the first place because there are so many good fishermen over the last 5, 10, 20 years that I've known that have just vanished. They burn out, they push too hard, they forget the love for fishing, and they're gone. So today, I'm taking you guys along with me. I am in the middle of nowhere. You guys don't know, part of my childhood, I grew up in and around Yosemite, went to a little one-room school, and I grew up fishing little tiny streams for little tiny native trout. Well, this stream is micro, but it's got really nice brook trout in it. So we're gonna go chase them around. You guys are on the road with me. I'm with my family, actually. We're just out taking a break, re-energizing, getting pumped up to push through summer and catch a bunch of fish. Looking forward to it, but today, let's hit the creek. Oh, that was a nice fish. We're gonna get him. Oh, that is a big fish for a little creek. What a beautiful brook trout. This is the stuff I grew up on. There's a good one. Thank you. That hole is too good. I'll bet he has a friend in there. Let's find out. Oh, missed him. Well, he does have a friend. Oh, got him. Oh, we lost him. That hole. Oh, missed him. Got him. That is a really nice brook for a little tiny creek. Hands are still wet from the last one. Hey, buddy. Such awesome fish. Got him. Look at that pool. How perfect. 
Oh, we're getting bit here. Got him. Look at the size of these native fish out here in this little tiny nothing creek. Let's turn him loose. Look at him. Beautiful fish. Amazing. They're not big, but they are gorgeous. Look at him. Gorgeous. All right, guys, we're gonna wrap it up here. I hope you enjoyed coming along as much as I enjoyed doing this. Uh, about once a year, I really try and get back to my roots. And this stream is not random. This is a place that I've actually fished since I was a little kid. We're off of Highway 395 uh, in the Eastern Sierra, up at about 7,500 feet fishing the smallest panther martin I could get my hands on. Four pound fluorocarbon, ultra, ultra light rod. I'll link you guys all the gear that I use, well, some budget gear, uh, if this is something you wanna do to get back to your roots. But whether it's little panfish, little tiny bass, little trout, it doesn't matter. Remember where you came from. Uh, getting back into places like this, into these little fisheries, forgetting about the fast boats and big electronics, and remembering why you did this in the first place will make you a better fisherman the whole rest of the year. It makes it easier to go out there and be successful, but it also makes it easier to go out there and struggle and to grind and to put in the time to accomplish your goals. So don't be afraid to do it, but also take the time, spend some time with your family, spend some time with your friends and take a break this year. Just go have a good time. If you enjoyed the video hit that like button subscribe to the channel we'll get back to our regular bass fishing here in a couple of days we'll talk to you soon